first few projects with GMA talaga na title role was a dubbing dubbing role ng isang telenovela sa sa, sa tanghali before it bulaga all my love tapos yung may patiser pa nun, ang bosses ay si Isa Calzada tapos ganoon pa yung pose <laughs> alala ko alala ko na grabe <laughs> pinapatos talaga dito sa bahay namin talaga um there were Juday, Claudine, tapos sumunod, Iza talaga. Iza Kalsado. Oh, kasi naging kapuso oh, kami nung time na yun. Totoo, mami. Oh my God. Kasensya na ABS, pero nung mga panahon talaga na yun na, lalo na yung tita ko, sobrang naging fan talaga siya. So parang, ay, Iza Kalsado sa TV. Mm-hmm. Tita, thank you. Oh my God. Ay, kililig ako. <laughs> Sobra <laughs> talaga. Oo. Yun, yung All My Love was a brief dubbing stint in between kung mawawala ka and te- Oh, Te amo, so, yung partner mo dito, yung, yung sa Monica Brava na lalaki. Tama yes. ba ako, Monica? Ah! Yes, Segundo Cernatas. Gra- oh, oh. Grabe. <laughs> ang ano, anong mga show? Siguro ang maganda lang yung nga, hindi ako nagkaroon ng awkward stage. Kung baga para ako ng bulaga, siguro, kapag in- hindi ko siya naisip noon, ha? pero kapag isipin ko siya ngayon, parang, where did I come from? And suddenly I was there. Mm. parang ganun eh yung napakaswerte ko actually pag inisip ko parang because I know there are people now who really been here na hindi pala natin alam 10 years na just mm-hmm. ko yung tas tsaka lang magbibigyan ng break and, and that's really iba din naman yun by the time they get it yung gutom iba yung na gutom gutom oh, 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 oh. tsaka yung iba na rin yung pagpapasalamat mo versus ako nun not that I was ungrateful but I didn't really understand the weight. Mm-mm. The weight of what was being given to me. Because nga, now I understand. Kasi, kumbaga hindi ako naghirap ng todo. But I had some, ano ah, yung I got rejected for certain projects. I had this and that. It wasn't always uh, smooth. Mm-hmm. Which is good. Because, good in my opinion. Because it, it really builds character. You were supposed to do Darna. Well, yeah. <laughs> na inupukan na na oo oh, oh, ng mga ganoon oh, oh. kumusta paano nangyari yun paano napunta sa lap mo tas nawala siya bigla inupo ako uh, Will Magalvante my manager at that time who was the head of at Art Center Ita Ida told me told us na I was chosen to to play the superhero and of course the papa what seriously you me have you seen my body that was the first initial talaga knee-jerk reaction to yun yung may ele- a sense of elation but at the same time apprehension because oh my god how i don't even wear poopies mm-hmm. have you seen my body yung ganon yung huh? so Anyway, I said that in the interview, we did things, we did cosmetic surgery, but of course, it's not going to change my body like that. It wasn't going to be a dramatic change, but I did it because I was hungry, mm-hmm. you know, like really want to make it. It was an opportunity of a lifetime mm-hmm. and I, I was young and I've done a lot of things to my body that I would not do at the Illumiani Park. Patang pati, nag-isip ko yung gano'n. So, yeah, so I, I ended up, I mean, not getting the role. And I really think it was meant for Angel. I mean, she really had a the body for it. Because Darna's in yes. two piece. She had the body for it. She had, the, you know, the beauty for it. She had the strength for it. She was very athletic, diba? She was a swimmer. So she she had that like she had that energy because at that time ta kasi wala ko lang mag workout. I mean, my fitness level now, I can do that. But hmm. yung fitness level ko at that time, I mean, I don't think I would have been able to deliver. But I understand that if you look at me with clothes on, I understand. Yung uh, ako din, I would choose. Uh, <laughs> Darna is, 'di ba? Ganito yung, I have the height, I have you know, the skin color. Aspect. Yeah, the skin the color, color the features. The features. Mm-hmm. But then, you know, it's, yes. it's, yes. it. What as long as it's nakatupis, ay, sa inyo na yan. 
Ang yun na yun na yung magano, magano ni Jen. Pero like you know, life always has a funny way of doing things. And uh, basa, it was informal. Yes. But at that time, of course, it was painful. I won't go into detail. But anyway, uh, they made us audition pa. At tapos na, yung parang alam ko nang hindi akin to. Nag-audition mm-hmm. pa. So I don't want to go to the audition. Nag-audition ako na ka-body stockings. Hindi lang yung stockings, sa Pati dito. Kasi sobrang insecure ko tayo. Hindi mo ako makikita ang naka-sleepless. At at uh-uh. yung, yung running down na ba? O ganito. Yes, yes. So, uh-uh. Sobrang balot ako lagi. Kasi sobrang kong conscious. Mm-hmm. sa katawan ko talaga. So, I remember, I did that audition and for real was there, siya, nauna siya sa akin. Yung audition na yun became the basis, to my knowledge, uh, became the basis for casting of Inkantan. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Ayan na! <laughs> Nag-open siya to another door. Exactly. Uh-huh. And, you know, that's just, maybe that was part of it. I don't know. And in yes. Encantadia, because it's not a friend, it's not an existing material. 